Hey everyone, I'm your pal Vikanyan. I'm back with more Synctum 2. Now we're going to the gate, and uh, holy cow, this level's... This level's nuts. Now I have my privacy, my game privacy is set to private, uh, but eventually I'm definitely going to need help with these Reporting levels. Uh, and at that point, I think I want to keep the uh, hand cannon. Um, but I definitely want to exchange the Gatling for the Kairos, which slows enemies. Or, you know what, actually, we might need the Violator for this one. Yeah, I think that's fair. I think that's good. Uh, weapon damage, I have increased by 40, but it disables weak spot hits. Um, actually, let's get the Lightning Bounce for our weapon discharge. Okay, so here we have... Three different spawns locations instead of two, but they all eventually have to come through this area where these guys are all standing. So, um, what I'm initially going to do is I'm going to uh, place a couple of violators here. Now, that initially looks horrible, and that's because that will be initially. But what we can do to kind of mitigate how bad it is, is One tower at a time. to force enemies. Actually, let's do... We're going to force enemies, essentially, to all funnel out of one location, one central location. Because they're going to come out of here as well. So, and these guys, I can't really save. They're just kind of going to die. And it's... This will do it. Sad, messed up, and depressing, but I can't, I can't tell them where to stand, or at least I haven't been able to figure out how to tell them where to stand. So initially, what we're going to do is we're going to go back these guys up. All right. This is... I don't know, we might be able to do this first wave without losing anybody. Yeah! That's pretty good. Alright, so now they're gonna start coming out of this other spawn spot. Uh, which is fine because we... That's what we're kind of... Oop. Kind of what we're preparing for. Now, just because we build a tower base here doesn't mean we can't pop defenses on top of them. So basically the whole point of doing that was to funnel them both to come through this one singular point. Now I I think the best bet for me to the best thing for me to do right now is to add some defenses here. Um or we could put our last violator up. Yeah, how about that? Ba boom. Now they'll come out of there eventually. And, as with the previous doors, it's a shame that I can't tell those guys where to stand. But, uh, we'll start the setup there initially. Okay, get ready. You're finished. So, luckily, these guys... They, the enemies in this game kind of tend to just... Oh boy. Oh boy. They got through. Ah, uh, there's screamers here too. Alright. Oh, okay. Can you not scream at me? Thanks. The screamers kind of just throw giant boogers at you, and it's awful for everyone involved. All right, I want. This is gonna get him. We're going to basically wall this whole section off. Killing off them, one tower at a time. All right. And now I'm out of tower, like, bases like to put stuff on so what we're going to do is we are going to set a couple of decent defenses because now it's 
starting to get to the point where um, this is going to be the area where a lot of the enemies will be funneled through. So, I don't necessarily feel bad putting cowards there. Now these guys, these guys are kind of initially screwed. Because there's no way to, no way to move them and they just kind of choose to stand there. Alright. This hand cannon's doing a really good job though. Oh man, one guy left. Can he survive? Nice. Yes. Yes he can. And we have seven more like tower bases to put through. Alright, so now what we're gonna do. Let's see. I want one here. What we're going to do is we're going to essentially force the enemies to have to like funnel through this all this one area. This is and by doing this, we're building basic. Like you guys can see what I'm doing, right? I'm basically just building an area where um, they have to come through one singular path if they want to get through here. And those violators are great because they're going to start shooting at the enemies um, like the second they spawn in and start spawning into these areas. So right now and what I'm wanting to do is let's build up some deep... Oh boy, that... They didn't really give me as much time as I would have enjoyed. So... I'm not gonna worry about keeping like the single dudes alive. I'm just gonna stand here and I'm gonna clean up what comes through. Alright, here we go, here we go. This is working. It'll work better and better the more and more uh, defenses I'm able to put up oh boy oh boy we got we got small ones going through that's fine I think that's fine whoa okay oh all right thank you violator holy crap all right they're gonna be coming through pretty whoa You're finished. I don't like those bangling ones There we go, there we go, there we go. My headphones almost fell off. Alright, cool. So, let's see. Wave 5 of 8. These levels are going to get longer and longer the more the more we keep going. Um, I would like to have a cannon there. And let's make this maze a little bit more complex while we're at it. There we go. The more complicated we can make this, the better off we're going to be. Do I really not have a violator in the center one there? Oh my. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. Um, it's fine because we are going to... We're going to be good on uh, defenses. It's going to be great. Okay. Alright, here we go. Oh boy, that's not good. That's not good at all. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, we're good. I think that armored heavy can go down. I'm hoping that the ones that get past me get cleaned up, which it looks like they are. 
It looks like they are big time. Okay, that's not great. Let's get close to him. So he's armored, so if I switch to my normal gun and try to fire, it's not gonna hurt him. Alright, alright. Um you know what, we have enough for a violator. Let's get a fourth one in. Killing off Burma. One tower at a time. And now let's complicate our maze. Now I can't put down more maze blocks without killing off these dudes. Um ugh. That's unfortunate, but I kind of just need to make sure that this is as complex as humanly possible. Alright, I think my problem is I have no initial defenses over here. So next round, next wave, I'm going to have to adjust th for that. Uh, that's great. Soakers are not really what I was looking forward to seeing. There we go. Alright, this is going well for us so far. I think the lightning bounce has really been helping here. All right, cool, cool, cool. Um, I think, yeah, yeah. I I said I was gonna do this. I need to upgrade a tower. Um, hang on. What are the range of the violators? Okay, they, these are these would be the best to upgrade, but I can't. I don't have quite enough to upgrade them all the way yet. So, first thing I'm probably going to upgrade is actually this electrical tower here. I had just enough for that. I had barely enough to upgrade that one. Alright, I think that's it. Whoa! Uh, let's not actually have that one there. All right, here we go. Here they come. I. There's an armored one. Yeah, I'm worrying about the armored one a little bit here. Let's make sure we can get some damage off of this guy here, because otherwise it's just going to be a problem down the road. Ah. Alright, looks like I have to kind of come back up here further up the line. Alright. Oh boy, he's got a lot of health left. Oh yeah! Oh yeah, that got cleaned up real nice. And now there's this one. All right, hand cannon's doing its work. Excellent. All clear for now. Got him. All right. You know what? Let's upgrade one of our violators here. We have enough. Yes. There we go. Now, I can't... I don't think I can make our maze any more complex than it already is. I could plug up 
uh, specific entryways to this. This is gonna get him. So if nothing else, that'll just make it so that you know what? Let's go ahead this and just do it. put those there because if nothing else. What this means is I have a stable platform to run on if I need it, and like if they get close. Or I could layer this t full of like, well, I take that back because I could only have three more defensive towers. So we're okay, just going to get, get ready here. What the hell? Oh yeah, okay. Okay. Oh, that's that's less good for me. This is actually okay. That's bad. I would really like my upgraded violator to kick in here. Maybe it has been, and that's actually the problem. There it is. There it is. I have to avoid getting. Knocked out. Oh, it's not armored. What am I doing? Okay, well, most of the maze is uh, destroyed. Oh, that was the level. That was the level. And that was a boss enemy. So. All good. So, actually, uh, peek behind the veil here. I thought he was going to show up the wave before the last one. Oh, rockets. Whoa, okay. What is this? Tactical juxtaposition. Slow weapons. Fast weapon. Oh, so... Everything's just better now? Is that what I'm understanding? Anyway, I'll see you guys next time for more Sanctum 2. I am loving this game. And I can't wait to show off more of it to you guys. I'll see you guys next time.